snowbound forests of Sweden's Varmland, preparing to welcome some of the best drivers on earth for round two of the World Rally Championship. Sweden, hugely popular with rally fans. Thousands routinely flocking to the forests, not least the famous Collins Crest, where the cars take off. Literally, it's one of the most spectacular sights in motorsport. Rally Sweden also features a swift cross-border foray into Norway. It's the only full-blown snow event on the calendar and one of the most popular rallies of the year. It's fantastic. I always enjoy uh, going there. It's my home event. Basically, we do one day in Norway, but even the stages in Sweden is, is home to me. So uh, it's, uh, it's my favorite event of the year. A uh, lot of emotion connect, connected to it with uh, all my friends and families there. And uh, it's, uh, it's a highlight of the year. The average speed on this rally is very, very high and yeah, it's just enjoyable, you know. Uh, the landscape is very beautiful and we are flying around with the cars through the, through the, over the roads uh, in, uh, with very high speed. So it's, it's something uh, particular and, and rare for us. For me, I have to say it's my favourite surface. To drive in a, in a winter wonderland, we hope it's going to be a winter wonderland uh, with loads of snow and uh, good snow banks. But yeah, the pleasure to drive on these Michelin tires with the studs at 200 kilometers an hour sideways. It's a special, special feeling and uh, it's one event we really, really look forward to. Beautiful stages. Hopefully the conditions will be perfect. But it, it's just a feeling to drive on snow and ice with, uh, with the studs, the length of the studs we have. It's uh, indescribable and you can really use the snow banks to lean on it. Closer, tougher, breathtakingly real. This is WRC Plus. Sign up now.